Hey guys, goody. This is not planned, so let's just get into it. Let me tell you really quick. I promise I am not poor. I promise I do not only just own this shirt. I know it looks and this hat. Perfect. Trust me, we've tried to do um other mukbangs with different outfits, but this wasn't planned, so we're just here about to eat and listen this is gonna be the epic cheat meal of our life because mm -hmm. we haven't done this in god knows how long two years we got a mcchicken right here thank you jesus we got french fries right here nice but i want a bite of the big mac i'm gonna take yeah. a bite of my brother's big mac yo last night let me tell you what happened last night me and donnie had the only party they didn't give us no sauce whatsoever like Oh, that's okay. That, that pisses me off, man. Yeah, ask me. I let it go, sis. I let it go. And before anybody says anything, we share each other's food. We don't care. We don't mind. This is who we are. And that's it. Okay? Big Mac. I've been dying for this for the longest time. Okay? Mmm. Mm -hmm. mm, let me get a bite. Mm-hmm. 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 You got the pickle. Um. So what the Let me pour him some fries because actually let me throw this pickle in here. Yeah, dump them in there. Yeah, man. No sauce whatsoever. Coño, pica que me da eso because she asked me sweet and sour and barbecue. Yeah, man. Here you go. And guess what I got me? Uh Triple cheeseburger. I'm gonna put them right mm -hmm. here because they don't fall. <clears throat> I got me a strawberry cream pie. We were up till four o'clock in the morning. We had the only party last night. Mm. It was amazing. Oh man, I'm dropping lettuce all over the place. It doesn't matter. Just napkins here for whoever needs some. Um, me and Marley were crying last night. It was just one of those things that. Look at that. Hold on. Let me. Let me. The sunlight. I tried to park somewhere where there was not sunlight, but I'm meeting it. So. Okay. Look at that. My hands shaking. Like literally. Yo, this shit look busting. Mine's just so delicious. Mmm. Mmm, try that. Mmm. Mm. Holy mother of God, thank you. Thank you for this meal. I'm getting my hat all dirty. Like. So the reason we was crying last night is because <clears throat> we were just talking about stuff that we needed to talk about. I feel like I don't really express my emotions or like we weren't taught to like talk about stuff no, we about our, our problems like mm -mm. we weren't taught it's to, like you deal with it mm -hmm. however you deal with it mm -hmm. and that's it and it's like you deal with it quietly mm -hmm. you want chicken nugget um deal with it quietly and that's it that's just what what it was I apologize for this truck, but, and since we're always together and stuff like that, like sometimes we're around each other so much that sometimes you start like losing respect for mm -hmm. the people around you. Mm -hmm. and that's when you need to come back to reality. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That happens to me a lot. It's like a marriage. Sometimes you lose respect for your, your, your spouse. Mm -hmm. It happens, mm -hmm. you know. I don't want to hear it. The best of the best have gone through that, you know. Mm -hmm. um, it's just reality. So we had to talk about a lot of things. Bad area to park mm -hmm. at. We parked in an area where it's just like a parking thing, and obviously there's people here, like. So, they probably think like we're filming them or something like that. But this is our area. I don't know about y'all, but like, let's change the topic really fast. I don't know about y'all, but like, if I find a specific spot to park in, 
If I go to a church and I park in a certain area, I feel like that's my parking. I feel like that's my stool, like that's my, my chair. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't get mad, but yeah, I be like- You're not the only one that feels like that. I'm cause... like, oh man, they took my parking. Or, oh man, they took my my my, my, my favorite chair, yeah, my favorite board. But I don't be like, oh, that's mine. No, I don't I do that. I think people are like that all the mm -hmm. time. Cause when I used to go to my grandma's house, my uncle had a favorite spoon that you couldn't touch. Mm -hmm. My grandpa sits at the end of the table. Mm -hmm. Like, grandma has her own little chair mm -hmm. that she sits at. Mm -hmm. So it's like, I think everybody does that. Look you know? at this little shape uh, chicken nugget. So back to what we were talking about. Well, sometimes I just hold my emotions in. When I drink, I feel like I could say whatever I want. So we had a conversation last night and I was thinking last night, damn, like, it's so cool that I could talk to my sister about anything. Like, we talk about anything any other time, like, but when it comes to our feelings. Sometimes we got to fight it out because mm -hmm. we're the same person. And it's funny because, to be honest with you, we've been watching T and Tamara, mm -hmm. which we love T and Tamara because we used to watch Sister Sister and obviously we have the CD. I mean, the DVDs, because we're a fan. Mm -hmm. But we didn't watch their TV show. I seen, like, an episode two when it came out, but I wasn't interested in it. Now we're watching it. And they were saying how they cannot talk to each other because they get defensive. Mm -hmm. Sometimes we go through that. Mm -hmm. Like, lately, I've been talking to her sometimes, and I get so frustrated with her. Like, I talk to her like I want to fight her sometimes. Mm -hmm. And I don't know that I'm doing it. And I'm like, I got to nip that in the bud, because... If I talk like this to my family, I can easily disrespect anybody else, mm -hmm. and I'm not doing that. Mm -hmm. I'm human enough to be mature enough to be like, yo, you got to get checked. Mm -hmm. You were checked last night, and I feel such like a better energy, better spirits, because sometimes life just happens to us. Yeah. And like I say all the time, I was able to be blessed with the platform, right? But I don't ever want to come on this platform and mislead you guys in any way. Because I'm not doing that. And it's just like, this conversation needed to happen. Mm -hmm. But. This food is good today. Mm -hmm. I'm so full. Like, ugh, beyond full. Yo pensé que I was going to eat the whole thing. But like, I've trained my body to eat to like, I'm full. Because back then, it, there was no telling me when to stop. Mm -hmm. Um, I be eating like a baby nowadays. Mm -hmm. Like, mm -hmm. Like, I don't, I don't feel the need to overindulge, you mm -hmm. know? Like, right now I'm enjoying myself and, and, and my new body and stuff like that. And it makes people uncomfortable because they've never seen me this small. Mm -hmm. That's your problem. That's not my issue. Mm -hmm. All my life I've been told that I was fucking fat, you know? And now that I'm on my tiniest, it's a problem. So, y'all gonna have to deal with it. Mm -hmm. I, I can't Like, somebody right. said the other day, oh, um, y'all look like you're on crack. And I'm thinking to myself, Senores, you can't please nobody. No se lleven de lo que la gente le diga. Don't worry about what people say because if we're big, we're too big for ya. If we're skinny, we're too skinny. If you want to say I'm on crack, I'm on crack. I'm, on, I'm high on life. I'm happy. I had my discussion. We had the only party last night. One more drink. And God knows what would have happened to me. And then, I would have fell down the stairs. Something would have happened. Well, you almost fell. It was showering. Yeah. I don't even remember that. I dropped my chopstick. I can't find my chopstick. It was fun last night. Like, I'm like, damn. Like, this is this is fun to be able to have somebody that doesn't judge you. You could tell them anything. Like, it was so much fun. It was so much fun. It and was, lately, every day, I kid you not, for the last couple of weeks, I've been listening to music, drinking every night. Mm. Not like a lot, you know. There's days that we just sit downstairs and we don't drink. Yeah, we Sometimes don't drink we'll all the time. Sometimes we'll just drink water. Mm -hmm. And that's like my drinking session. Yeah. Or, you know, sometimes we'll have like a tea. And sometimes I jam to music and I'll listen to tea. I mean, drink to tea because y'all know what I'm saying. I'm bummed out. Yeah, I try not to drink every day. I, price. I ain't trying to be an alcoholic out here. But, like, we just be having fun. Like, you know, like. Life is short. Mm -hmm. like, life is so short. And it's just like, there's so much going on in this world that I try to live my life the best way that I can. The most happiest that I can. Because 
man like i i can't even be going on social media because there's so much going on on social media that yeah y'all see social media y'all know what i'm talking about i'm not gonna talk about it here but i'm just saying like i can't what's goody so we got chinese food we got some fried rice that we made i'm gonna link it down below i apologize if you hear my dog like okay so that i'm gonna link it down below the last time we made it we put shrimps this one has crab meat so i don't know if you can see that right there so we also got crab ragoons we got broccoli here and brown sauce so i'm gonna open it up and I got, um, so I got the, um, shrimp and crab meat, um, egg soup. It's called actually shrimp and lobster sauce. Okay, whatever This called. is, uh, which I was annoyed because I thought that they didn't give us, um, white rice. And they did, so. Bon appetit. So let me tell you. Now I'm going to try to break the bottom of this plate so that we can. Yeah. I forgot to bring the menu that's over there because I wanted to talk to you guys mm. about something. Let me tell y'all something. Back in the day, let me see how we're going to eat this because there's too much. This tape was way too little for us, but let me try. My mom and my dad got us to eating this because my dad used to always get it. He used to always get the shrimp egg drop soup with the white rice. So as a little girl, I used to watch him, and I'm like, what is that? I'm mm. like, mmm. That's busting. Let me get the menu real quick, you guys, because mm. I want to... First of all, you don't even like eggs like that. Second of all, this is like a sopa. You can't eat this, Papa. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Let me get um, crab rangoon. So I was annoyed because... You know, I don't want to complain in this video, but like, I don't know if y'all go through that, dip it and do it. But Chinese food is getting expensive, y'all. Like, yo, back in the days, we used to be able to get, um, mm, look at that. Chicken wings and french fries for $5.25. Chicken wings with plain fried rice or pork fried rice, $5.25. It's $9 now. Let me open this up because Marlena's talking and you guys can't even see her because she don't be paying attention to the details. So. I'm just eating and talking to y'all, so it is what it is. So. Hold on, you guys. Mm. So, yeah, we were looking at the menu and I'm like, man, like, I know this is going to bother some of y'all, so let me try to think. So, I was looking at the menu and I was like, let me check how much is the food out here? Mm -hmm. So I was checking, okay, chicken nuggets for 12 of them, plain, is $7.75. Okay, with fried, french fries or fried rice is $9.50. With pork or chicken is $9.95. With beef and shrimp is $10.50. And I'm like, holy smokes. Back then with $5, you used to go to the Chinese food place and get you chicken nuggets or chicken wings with right with either white rice or plain fried rice. I'm like, mm-mm. Mm-mm. And yes, like when we order from these people, like yesterday I wanted crab sticks, so I had went there to get crab sticks. And usually when you go to a place, right? Like if you order chicken wings. It's only common sense for the person that you're buying from to be like, what kind of dipping sauce? A, a chicken wing comes with a dipping sauce automatically, just like my crab sticks. Yesterday, they charged us a dollar for tartar sauce. Mm -hmm. My dude, that comes with it. What's going on uh -huh. here? I'm like, uh-uh. And the, mm, the, the crab sticks only come with four. I used to be five for eight dollars. Now it's four, and they don't even want to give you tartar sauce for free. We know this because y'all yeah, know we're fast, so we know about food. Mm -hmm. We know prices. We know taste. We know where to go, where not to go. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Let me show you my rice a little bit because you can't even see it. Tu no quiero un chingo de sopita. I'm gonna have a little bit. The broccoli is busting. Yeah, I'm gonna have. It's a little bit too hard, like. 
hard. And yeah, like too crunchy. Usually they make it a little bit more softer, but it's still good. I mean, let me try it because I do like hard stuff. Pause. But no, yeah. don't pause on that because I do like hard stuff. But All right. Let's try this. Hold on. It's good, but it's crunchy. Let's try this soup because you already know this soup comes with uh, peas and shrimps. Mmm. El diablo, que vaina que está buena. I don't know if you guys can see that. It doesn't look too appealing. Actually, guys, I wanted to ask y'all too. Do you guys like the setup? A black backdrop. Um, I wanted to ask y'all, what is good to get from Chinese food? Because I feel like I always get the same thing. Either it's um, boneless spare ribs with house special fried rice or pork fried rice and egg roll and my crab sticks and my crab rangoons. But there's other stuff like hot and sour soup. And they don't give a description. You know what I'm saying? Like beef egg foo young. What is that? That has to be eggs with something in it. Um, pork ho fun. Chicken ho fun. Am I saying this right? Uh -huh. Like it's supposed to be ho. I think it's supposed to be hun. No, oh. it's H O. Hun. Ho. Ho. Beef with mushrooms, beef with garlic sauce. There's so many things. Let me know down below so one day if I go to like a Chinese food place. Like we grew up going to the, excuse me, Apollo. Well, right where we used to live in Brooklyn, there was a Chinese place right down the, the like right down in the corner. Mm. Like we go down the stairs from the, the crib and the Chinese food like literally next door. This so, is so good. <clears throat> this soup is bomb. Bomb. So good. You want some more soup? No. Here you go. Yeah, yeah I'm going to have some more. But mm. This is good. I just grew up eating this. Like, it brings back so much memories. Like, just going every Sunday was family day in my house. Tate tranquilo, muchacho. My dog, you would think that he don't eat. You guys would think that he does not eat. Um... But yeah, every Sunday was family day. We would get ready, wait for my dad to come from work. We would wait for him. And um, we would go, he would take us around like Chinatown. Every week, every Sunday was a different outing. Every Sunday he would take us somewhere new. Like whether it was to Brooklyn, somewhere in Brooklyn, downtown to look at homes. And I think that's why we're so like into homes and stuff like that. I think... um. Also, we used to always go to Coney Island or mm -hmm. Grandma's house. Or mm -hmm. I think some days that's why we want to do start incorporating now. Because we're much more sure, much older. Now that my dad lives with us, we want to bring those days back and do it bigger and better. Because now we're much more older. We're not children anymore. So we could do so much more. And I think it'll be better now. Not only that, like... We work, we make money, now we could take him out. You know what I'm saying? Like, mm -hmm. back then, he used to take us out. And every Sunday, I could tell you this, every Sunday was either McDonald's or we would go to a new restaurant, whether it was a diner, whether it was Chinatown to try new Chinese food. Um, Pizza and then Hut? Pizza Hut was every Friday. Pizza Hut was every Friday, and that's why every, that's why Pizza Hut is more, like, dear to my heart because of those memories that we have. Before going to church, we would go to Pizza Hut every Friday. Mm -hmm. Never failed. Mm -hmm. Never. Mm -hmm. So, I'm going to be honest with you. I'm so pissed off right now. Come on. This is good. Excuse that I just did that. <clears throat> so, because this is crab rangoon and they ask crab meat. If you don't clean the crab meat well, it has those little shells. So I bit into a couple of them. Ew. Really? Mm -hmm. Mine don't have it. Like, just like the little small fine ones. You know mm -hmm. how when you have like, you eating eggs and mm -hmm. you feel, oh. I know what you're saying. So yeah, it's just, it's just nice when family like gets together and does so much stuff together. Like, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I don't know, like. Those memories, like, you never forget those memories, ever. Like, something that will stay with you for the rest of your life. Mm -hmm. 
Mm -hmm. That's why I like to create new memories now with my family because you only live once. Mm -hmm. And usually what happens in life is you think that the that begin the beginning part of your life is the most important. When in reality, the more you mature in life, the more you hit def different um, seasons in your life, the better it gets. You learn how to maneuver certain things. You know how to enjoy certain things. You know how what not to stress out on. Like with this one, sometimes I got to tell her, chill, because she be so stressed over the littlest things. I'm like, it's not that serious, D. She only thinks it's me. She'll, she'll just tell the world my side, but she won't ever say her side. God forbid. Do I get stressed easily a lot, though? No. Is that one of my worst qualities? Not stressed, but like, I'll tell her, help me with this, help me do this. Like, I be doing a lot. A lot. I'm really kind of lazy sometimes. I'm not going to yeah, lie. I am lazy. I just like doing things my way. And the thing is, like, let's say she's cleaning the bathroom. And we're all supposed to be cleaning at the same, like, if we take a Saturday, we say we're going to clean. And she starts cleaning the bathroom. If me and Jose are not doing something at the same time she's doing it, Guys, she's I want to I wanna get it over and she's done with. She's bitching because all the when time, she's right? doing something, everybody got to do something or else it's a problem. That's how it goes, right? Because if I finish cleaning the bathroom and I want to hit the room or the hallway and the hallway is not dry yet, what are we doing? I'm not trying to step on, you know, clean floor. Like, we're not playing these games here. It's either we all going to do it at the same time or not. And half of the time, like, I, I be in and out. Me and Jose, zoom, 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 zoom. We be quick with it because I want to I wanna get it done with. And now that the, the summer's starting, like, it be so hot. I be sweating like I was hitting the bike. No, and not only that, we like to get everything done in the morning because at nighttime, just like after this video, we partying. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So, wow, that soup is everything. Yeah, I'm about to cut this off right now. Because... I didn't eat the shrimps because I'd be low-key, like, scared if they don't clean them well, you know what I mean? But oh, this soup... I'm about to take this to work tomorrow, to be honest with you. Like, it's good. Everything it's, is good. It's delicious. You got to eat it with the white rice, though. Like, dunk it in the white rice. Mm -hmm. It's really good. I'm telling you. We Are y'all surprised we like that? Because I wonder yeah, if it's we, um, I like the egg drop soup. That one, I think mm -hmm. it's called. And I was going to try, yeah. The egg drop soup is amazing. I don't think I tried. I think I tried the wonton soup before. Yeah. I was uh -huh. going to try the... Oh, I tried the wonton egg drop soup. Did you want to try egg foo young? I wanted to try the seafood soup, mm -hmm. but I saw somebody eating it and they had shrimps in it. I mean, not shrimps, mushrooms. Some of them had mussels. So I'm like, do I want to get it or not? And then I was Googling online and so many different like Korean food, all types of food. So I'm like, you know, I don't know what's in it. You know what I'm saying? So, mm-hmm. Let me tell y'all, this was fun to record, to record McDonald's and to record Chinese food. But let me tell y'all something, I'm done. <laughs> y'all not getting not, this again. Y'all not getting this again. For a while. Yeah, I only got this because we was toe up from the flow up. I'm surprised I wasn't hungover the next day. I did my exercise. I did everything that I had to do. And so today, last night, I didn't drink or anything like that. I haven't been drinking and stuff like that, but... I We've did. been chilling. We did party last night, but mm -hmm. we didn't, she didn't drink. I have one beer. Mm -hmm. Um, So we just been laying low and stuff mm -hmm. like that, just trying to get my H2O intake in. And, you know, this, this food is delicious, right? But there's so much of it that you can eat. Now we got to go back to a clean slate. This was fun to record. If you guys want to see more videos like this, I don't. I'm not saying that we're going to do it anytime soon maybe when we go to florida we're gonna definitely do a couple different spots and stuff like that um yeah definitely mm -hmm. because and don't mind us please we just came from the movie theaters like a little while ago as well so you know i was hungry but i wasn't like overly starving mm -hmm. so i just wanted to throw that out there but i'm definitely gonna munch on this because the party starts right now and i hope that you guys are doing well Thank you so much for everybody that entered the giveaway. Thank you so much for the new subscribers. Um, we will be picking a few more winners. Uh, and mm -hmm. so with that being said, we hope you enjoyed this video. 
uh we'll see you next time i don't know what else we're gonna be dropping this week but we'll figure it out thank you guys so much for all your love for all your support and we'll see you next time bye guys